Recently, we had an inquiry from Catherine who asked the question, could I have something wrong with my veins, even though I can't see any problem, I can't see any varicose veins or thread veins? Catherine had a lot of ache and swelling, particularly at the end of the day. And the answer to your question, Catherine, is yes, you could have a problem with the veins, even though you can't see anything wrong on the surface. Let me explain. The root problem uh, that causes varicose veins, spider veins and other problems is a condition called venous reflux. You see, the function of the veins is to carry blood upwards from the legs back to the heart against gravity. And uh, inside the veins there is a delicate fold of the lining um, called a valve which keeps blood flowing upwards in the right direction. Now if these valves are faulty and not meeting properly then gravity can sometimes pull the blood back down in the wrong direction. And whenever anything travels in the wrong direction in the body, we give it the name reflux. So for example, some people get acid reflux indigestion when acid comes upwards um, instead of going downwards to digest the food. Now often people who have ache, swelling and tiredness of their legs, particularly at the end of the day, Often these people do in fact have venous reflux and they may or may not have anything to see on the surface apart from swollen ankles or swollen legs. Let me illustrate uh, the problem with a case history, a patient called Cheryl whom I treated recently. Cheryl Penn lives in Glastonbury in Somerset and for years she's been troubled by ache and swelling of her legs. At the time that I saw her, her ankles were very swollen, and you can see the impression of her socks, indicating that she has a condition called edema. This is fluid retention in the legs, caused by severe venous reflux. I treated Cheryl by endovenous radiofrequency ablation, or venous closure, under local anaesthetic, and her legs look much better. The swelling has gone her legs feel so much better, the quality of the skin is much improved. She's delighted. She calls it an ankle lift. So there you are. Cheryl is absolutely delighted that her legs uh, feel so much better. And of course they look better. The swelling and um, the uh, discoloration of her legs has improved considerably. And in fact she wasn't aware that there was a problem with her veins until she'd had a consultation and ultrasound scan. 